Howdy folks, I'm Effing Controller and I'm playing more Crusader Kings 2, wherein I continue to courageously connive against, that's not really courageous to connive I guess, but we are uh, plotting to take the Duchy of Armenia through unscrupulous means. Uh, let's go ahead and get the game started. <laughs> And, uh, the Allens in Cemender are now Georgians. Yay! That actually really helps because... Oh, it's Cemender, not... That would be interesting. Well, now these guys are Orthodox. And are you my patriarch? Well, go over there. Welcome home. Um, Prince Mirab, my son needs to be educated. Should I educate him? What are... I can't even remember what my educational trait is. flamboyant schemer. Well, that's not happening. Uh, actually, this guy, Great Eminence would be handy. Uh, just is a good trait. Zealous is not great in a kingdom that will potentially have multiple religions. Craven is not a good trait to have, and Proud is also not a good trait to have in a tutor. Shucky Ducky. You know what? Let's roll the dice. Let's do it. Get crazy. Alright, meanwhile, um, since Armenia is going to take a while to pan out, because as we discovered in the last episode, people don't really seem too excited about killing the Duke or his child. How old is she now? 14? I wonder if I could arrange a betrothal. That would be kind of weird. Yeah, wait a minute. They're cousins, aren't they? Uh, hang on a minute. Oh, but that would fuck everything up. No, that that's that's bad. We don't want that. Reason we don't want that. He's going to inherit the kingdom of Georgia. He wouldn't inherit anything necessarily. He might inherit a county over here, but and his kid would inherit the duchy of Armenia. I want it would be nice if I could have married him to that kid. <laughs> Did not think that part through. <laughs> Anyways. Just just thoughts. Those would be cousins also getting married. That's awkward. It's just it's just not a good scene here in the Kingdom of Georgia. So yeah, we're not gonna do that. However, oh my nephew Guarum would like a thief of his own. He can go thief himself. As far as I'm concerned. Now, since things are um, not really happening down here in Armenia, uh, I'm gonna, you know, turn my attentions to the north. What happened to you? Why did you leave me? Are you dead? Let's give it another, like a day, and see if he's dead now. What? You just decided not to be spy master? You can't resign, I fire you. I can make you spy master again. I wonder why that happens. That's happened to me before and it makes me suspicious. Somebody out there is probably saying you shouldn't have done that, but I don't know what it does. So I, I certainly do apologize for my ignorance, but there you go. That weak claim on Luxembourg. Uh, it looks like Kazaria is having some problems. What's happening here? What kind of... Oh, there's a Tengri uprising. Interesting. There's also some nonsense happening here. We're making a good amount of money every month. That's that's good. Money is good. Uh, let's see what else is happening in the wider world. Actually, when I... Uh, was clicking around prior to loading this game up, I saw that, well, yeah, Wessex is in a war... Oh, wait, they're not in a war anymore with uh, Denmark. What is it? Gilland and Sjaland? I don't know how to say those. I know it's probably not a hard J, but um, who knows? It could be a hard J's night. Um, these guys were at war with Wessex, so... Apparently, oh no, oh that's actually, that's actually not that bad. <laughs> this fucking game. Um, 
let's, let's turn our attention back home because that's actually a fairly important development. She died. She had a claim on the Duchy of Armenia. However, that claim has been passed to our eldest son, David. And David, then, has a weak claim on the Duchy of Armenia. So does his brother. Uh, she might. She does not. Okay. It will not be inherited unless pe uh, Preston born. So I need to hop on Pop here uh, and see about uh, how this is all going to go down. Um, it's on pause because there's really not much happening. I don't care about that. Um, is anybody bribable? A bullgrib is bribable in this plot, but that's not gonna that's not gonna cut the mustard. I just said that I was gonna turn my attention up to Kazaria. They appear to be in a bit of a war. Oh my god, they're getting rocked. They're getting the house rocked. I'm just gonna let them get killed a little bit. Just gently killed. Um, kind of look down here again, because, did I cancel that plot? Yeah, let's cancel that, because I'm not too sure about this now. And let, let's just make a double check here. Yeah, David is next in line after Soapy. <laughs> that name cracks me up. Um, oh, the Duke of, uh, of Kazia is having some civil unrest. Uh, who is Yon? Io, I won. Oh, he might get his ass kicked. Actually, he's attacking with troops that are not as high of morale. This could be pretty crappy. I don't think I can actually join his war. Oh. Yeah, looks like he's gonna eke out a victory. Keeping this guy weak, even though he contributes troops and everything, um, is kind of a good idea. He owns a fairly sizable chunk of territory. I can just... Oh my god. I could just have him killed. This guy likes me more. Hang on a second. Wait, 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 wait. He's a part of the revolt? Oh, he might be supporting his son against him. Um, how's his son? His son is kind of a bunch of poop. He's kind of a big pile of doo-doo. I'm going to go ahead. Hang on a second. Let, let, let's see here. Now, that's the guy that's leading the revolt. And that would split up his territory, because I think previously, this county, maybe not. Maybe I should leave well enough alone. I don't know. I like the idea of killing people. What can I say? <laughs> Crusader Kings. Um, I'm going for it. Because I, I really doubt that we'll be able to... Uh, kill anybody of import down here. A son was born to Guaram, Adonasis, Zé, and Nino, named Alexander. Alexander. Uh, I like that. I'm just gonna go ahead and keep that. There we go. How's that plot looking now? Yep, looking pretty good. We got everybody on board. I can get him killed that would be pretty pretty keen I'm gonna I'm basically just killing time as well because uh, this these guys are going Hulkamania style here in uh, Kazaria and I don't want to uh, <laughs> I don't want to have to deal with them frankly sounds like kind of a problem uh oh I've got a little bit of a cold got some nighttime stuffiness do I have anybody in prison 
I do, don't I? Yes, I do. And they are not ransomable. Oh, come on. Let's get the kid out of here. The Nazgul. Release the Nazgul. And you can go too. There's no sense in keeping you in prison. You served your time. I feel better. That's great. It wouldn't be a, a terrible crisis, I don't think, if Bagrat died. I don't know. We'd be okay, right? I really like this, uh... Lot to oh, there you go. My co-conspirator, Kvarkavari, has procured a poisonous viper. It sends word that it will soon dig its fangs into the Duke of Bagrat. Is it a tunnel snake? Where are the tunnel snakes? Just a pointless reference. Oh, shit! You son of a bitch! Can I just... just brutally kill you? Oh, yeah, well... <laughs> they figured it out. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that'll do it. Oh, well. <laughs> Success? <laughs> I guess? I can kill him. <laughs> No, no, wait, don't. <laughs> oh, man, I am inept. Wait, who's his heir? The guy that led the revolt. Oh, he hates my guts. Because <laughs> he knows I killed his dad. That backfired. <laughs> well, okay. <laughs> oh... It's the circle of life. And we're gonna kill them all. Oh, dear me. What am I doing? <laughs> this is probably not the way a king should rule. But who am I kidding? Meanwhile, I'm just hoarding an absolutely obscene amount of money. Um, should I do anything with it? I don't know. I get the feeling that we're in kind of an interesting space. Spot here. Oh, we're gonna poison him with wine. Spill the wine. Come on. That's actually not a bad way of dealing with that situation, because I imagine, you know, oh, who are you? You're just a little baby. Oh, no. <laughs> well,. He's got a regent. This area is going to be a fucking mess for a while. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Woo, we're going to kill a baby, everybody. Yay, Crusader Kings! <laughs> he was literally just born in time for his... So, his father to die and pass. Oh my god. <laughs> this is awful. Just awful. Oh, come on. He frightened the maid off. <laughs> Maybe that's a sign that I really shouldn't be doing this. Oh, hey, meanwhile, we have... <laughs> I'm gonna cancel the plot, because I... I'm sorry, I just feel bad. I, I mentioned that I have some role-playing sentiments about this game, and that's just fucked up, man. <laughs> Come on. Oh, what is happening down here, meanwhile? Yeah, he's getting his shit packed in, that's what's happening. Um... Had multiple, multiple defeats. At Martyr Martyrpolis? It's probably not a very big town. Um, I want to look up here because there's been some interesting developments here. I bet you I could take these guys out. I think I could do this. Now, are you Jewish or Jewish? But wait, are you Jewish? 
You're Jewish. And are you Jewish? You're Jewish. And are you Jewish? No, you're not. Okay. How about you? Okay, so this is a little bit more complicated then. The reason that is, is because he can, if I do a holy war, he can call in all of his neighboring uh, Jewish rulers to fight me. However, he certainly is in no position to really fight, so that doesn't bother me. Same with him. Really him. He's, he's, he's fucked up, man. He is just, oof. Could take that territory. These are possibly better. Not really. They're not. Okay, I'm gonna take Alania then. Let me think I can take, yep. I can't believe I can eat the whole thing. My ruler is unmarried. I don't care about that right now. I forgot about that situation, I guess. I was too busy plotting to kill children. Literally infants. Uh-oh. Wait, what? King Bagrat? He's a king? Did he make himself king? That little bastard. Wait a minute. Hang on a second. Don't kill me. Oh my god, I can't do anything but approve it. <laughs> that fucking serves me right, I guess. I don't know if that's just going to be a plot that doesn't fire off on anybody or what. But <laughs> oh, that's funny. That's genuinely amusing. <laughs> All right, get get in there so that we can start uh, wrecking shit. Oh my kid, who is this? Shukia. This is my uh, granddaughter. Okay. <laughs> uh, how about you get educated by Rishield? Is that her uh, stepmom? I don't know. Oh my! Now they have a revolt going. <laughs> Their shit is just not working. <laughs> Their shit is broken. Yeah, High Chief Itaz the Cruel is trying to revoke Kuma right now. Why would you do that right now? <laughs> Maybe because it will preserve this from my conquests? I don't think it will. What happened? Why do we lose our steward? Wow, and we have nobody. I don't even know who my steward was. <laughs> Um, well, you sure are looking stewardish. Are you actually leading troops right now? Actually, I guess I can click on him. He is. It's one fighting bishop. All right. Well, good for you. You know what? After I conquer this holding. I'm gonna go mop the floor with them. It's probably more prudent to be expanding northwards anyways. I really would hate to lose my claim on, uh... Oh, well... He's gonna go ahead and surrender. Alright then. <laughs> Makes that simple. This uh, county, meanwhile, has been preserved. Are you... You are orthodox. I can't declare a holy war on him, then. That's amusing. 
amusing and amazing. That's very clever that that, um, that guy did that. I don't think it was by design in any way, but it's it's kind of funny. It's not a great holding anyway, so I don't know if I really care that much. Um, da -dum, da -dum, da -dum, da -dum, da -dum. Well, we have some uh, incorrect uh, vassalages that we need to get rid of, and I think we've just taken care of that now. Okay, well, we'll have to probably forge a claim on them, won't we? Oh, yeah, you're... See, now that was a stupid thing, too. I was thinking about that in the time that I wasn't playing. What would I even do if I had fabricated a claim on that? Would I press a press that in war? Because I could eventually press uh, a claim in war for the whole thing. <laughs> Dummy. Uh, I'm going to try to press a claim there. Fabricate a claim there. Why not? I don't really know if there's anything more worthwhile I can do. Uh, I have too many too many holdings. Let's see how much money I make uh, even with that problem. <laughs> I could very well be losing money, I suppose. No, I'm gaining money. Um, this guy's my vassal. And he's uh, orthodox, so hey, alright, whatever. Um, how did that guy become my vassal? I declared a holy war on them. Oh, because he's orthodox, that's why. <laughs> Figured it out. Okay, anyways. Um, meh, meh, meh. Meh, meh. Let's see if I can... Ooh, boy. I don't know if I really want to... Uh, mess with them right now. Wait, how come I can't press my claim? Count Grigor of Tau? Who the fuck? Who is that? How? Okay, that doesn't make a lick of sense. She, um, apparently... My brother-in-law died. She's now ruling, and she's terrible. Um, God damn it. I can bribe him to join it. Oh, man, that stinks. That stinks like a big old damp fart. That is not good. Um, well, okay. What happened to my spy master? Are you dead? No, you just quit? You can't quit, I fire you. Um, please don't quit? How about that? Oh, I have too many titles, too. I need to start focusing on that a little bit. Um, also, my domain size has gone down probably because... Um, okay, we got a lot of things going on here. Let's focus. Let's build the spy network back in... And me here, because that should help my plot possibly. Okay, so we got that going. Um, we need to work on my domain here, and that actually might be helped by arranging a marriage, getting hitched again. I could marry a princess of Bulgaria, and she's actually got some decent traits. Um, Bit of an age difference, but, uh, you know, it doesn't really matter. <laughs> Not my problem. Uh, she has good stewardship is really what I'm looking for, and that affects the size of my domain. That's really what my problem is here. If I can get some domain from my, or some stewardship from my wife, I can increase my domain. So let's actually try to find a character who is a lady, not in prison, not married, and any root, yeah, that's fine. Um, and my religion for now. Let's look at the stewardship. Actually, let's sort by rank. Bogna! Well, I've got a decent amount of prestige, so I can definitely take the hit. Um, we have a Greek Orthodox gal. 
who has some pretty good traits and she wants to get married she can get married to a 62 year old bearded man sounds like a winning proposition to me make it matrilineal <laughs> okay that should help actually meanwhile I do need to probably give away at least two of my that helped a little maybe I could uh, change aha see no I only need to give one away <laughs> Which one of these new counties is the worst? Kasogia is pretty crappia. So I think I'm going to give that to... I don't really have any relatives that I trust. Um, if you look at my family. See, I don't want to give it to Adonase here, even though he's older than me. That's interesting. I didn't notice that. Um, I could give it to one of his sons. I think I will do that. This guy's not really... He's militarily kind of a problem, but he's going to get a title that stinks. So, I'm going to give him the County of Kasogia. Okay, now we're back at the domain size limit. I don't think it would have been a big deal if we had... Um, strayed above that a little bit, but I don't know. Yeah, Duchess Soapy got her ass kicked. What do you know? Uh, let's take a look. You know, I might... Actually, I can. Um, okay, so I need to invite you to the plot and invite you to the plot. And let's see how that goes. So we're just above 100%. Uh, the plot might fire off, but it's a little bit remote. Meanwhile, this guy is apparently the heir. Uh, that's pretty annoying to me. I don't know how that exactly worked. But uh, maybe we'll have to dissect that in a later episode. How's that sound? Probably a good, uh, good time here to wind things up. So... This has been Effing Controller, playing Crusader Kings 2 as the Kingdom of Georgia. See you later.